up on your face, no gun plate. Let me relate a cup of lemonade over your face. Oh. Hey, what's going on guys? Evil Dragon in the building back again with another video and this time I'm going to teach you how to catch fish with a hundred percent success rate so never fail at catching fish again and it'll help you completing that one Nook Mouth challenge which I believe is the cast master of catching a hundred fish in a row without failing and I'm gonna teach you how to do that. So before you get started you probably are gonna want uh, actual fish fishing rods not the flimsy one so take a flimsy fishing rod, take a iron nugget, and then, you know, craft these. Because uh, you will be fishing quite a lot once you get this method down, I guarantee it. Uh, go ahead and hold that, and then we're going to go ahead and look for some fish. Now this is a very easy trick. Uh, we're going to go ahead and, of course, that fish goes away. Uh, but basically, the trick lies within closing your eyes uh, during your cast. And it's going to help you catch fish in a of time. So I'm going to cast it. I'm going to go ahead and close my eyes. And I'm going to reel the fish in. Now, you may think that this is just like, oh, it's super obvious trick. Or uh, it's a silly you know, thing to implement to close your eyes as you catch the fish. But I'm getting, I guarantee it, guys. Uh, if you close your eyes, you are going to get the fish 100% of the time. So basically, all you want to do is when you cast out your fishing line or your fishing rod, um, once the fish has the animation of like it's gonna go uh, towards your like little bait uh, to latch on, uh, close your eyes and you want to listen for the sound that happens when you know the fish bites onto it. Uh, the reason why this works is that when the fish is biting your little line multiple times, uh, the visual cue is kind of, let me close my eyes, there it is. Uh, so obviously I'm be catching lots of eggs because it's bunny day. Uh, but again, the reason why this works is because the visual cue of the fish kind of like, am I going to bite it or am I going to not, is messing up your timing. So you, what happens is you get too eager and then you end up, you know, pressing the button when you're not supposed to. Where if you just wait, close my eyes again, miss, got it, press A, right? Um... When your eyes are closed, you're not getting tricked by the fish, you know, tricking you multiple times whether he's going to bite it or not. And you just press A when you hear the audio cue of the uh, kind of it going under the water when the fish is bitten it. Close my eyes again. Miss. 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 There it is. And I press A once I hear it. Now, since I'm not looking at it, I'm not being tricked. I'm just relying completely on my ears in order to catch the fish. And as you can see, with this little run, I haven't missed catching a single fish. Uh, there's been no editing. I did that for that reason. Close my eyes. Man, press it. Makes it so much easier. And I know fishing isn't hard. It's an easy skill, but there's a lot of people that I've been talking with and they've gotten to uh 100 fishes i'm sorry 99 fishes in a row and they fail the challenge and they get really frustrated and i've seen people well i'm, I'm only gonna fish for five days in a row or sorry five fishes at a time and then kind of stop so i can you know that's it's gonna take 20 days to finish that where if you have one really good day of fishing you're never going to mess up as long as you you know you angle your you cast your line correctly where the fish sees it and the animation starts, close eyes, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, got it. See? And as long as you close your eyes and you just listen for the audio cue, you will be fine. Now, if you're using the Joy-Cons and I believe the Pro Controller, using the Joy-Cons or the Pro Controller, you might um, rely on the vibration cue. I don't find it consistent for me. Uh, when I rely strictly on the audio, it's like, a, it's been a hundred percent. Like I have not failed to close my eyes. Got it. Every single time guys, this method is foolproof. Um, you're never going to have any, um, unless you're like really shaky on the buttons and you, you press a on accident. That's the only time you can mess this up. We just do this one more time just to show you guys again, 
got to get it so the fish has the animation. This may be a little tricky because of the angle. Alright, let's do it. I should get it right here. Close my eyes. See that last one? See how we kind of how we kind of waited, but everything with my eyes closed. Bam! Just listen for that audio cue, and you'll be good to go. So that's it. Hopefully this helps you guys. Hopefully you guys are well on your way to uh, getting your hundred fishes in a row without failing. Um, now, if you're doing it right now, this second, uh, the Bunny Day event is going on, so. You're going to be catching lots of water eggs. You can see I have 27 in there right now. So this isn't going to count towards your 100 fishes in a row. Um, but if you're fishing a bunch and you're farming these, trust me, you're going to get well over 100 fish and you can teach your friends on how you became a fishing master. So this video helped. Make sure to give it a like or dislike. Doesn't matter. Uh, share it with a friend uh, who hasn't gotten their 100 fishes in a row. And until next time, I'm Evil Dragon. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. I don't know who let you in my head, ring the sirens I don't really wanna hear lies, bring me silence I don't